Happy Friday to you. I'm Ross DiMatte right now with your 13 Action News Update. Some breaking news overnight. A fire at an electrical substation near Decatur and Silverado Ranch. Look at that. Left more than 8,000 customers near Southern Highlands without power throughout the night. Some people were even evacuated from their homes, but they have been able to return. Right now it seems crews have that fire under control, but it did flare up just a few hours ago. Power is slowly being restored in that area. The $600 weekly unemployment benefit is set to expire for millions of Americans today. On Thursday, the White House offered an extension into next week, but that was rejected by Democrats who want a long-term solution included in the next stimulus package. Both sides have agreed to talk about unemployment again today and throughout the weekend. If you own a local small business that is struggling right now during this pandemic, there is help available. Clark County is offering grants worth up to $15,000 as part of its Small Business Rental Assistance Program. Applications for that program are due on August 4th. We have more information for you at KTNV.com. Well, the heat is certainly on. The excessive heat warning continues. We've got temperatures that are about 5 degrees warmer as you step out the door than they have been. So you'll feel the difference. Lots of sunshine. And we're all the way up to 107 at noon, setting the stage for a run toward 112 in Las Vegas. This afternoon could get as hot as 120 down in Laughlin. Excessive heat warning continues on Saturday. We're back to 112 tomorrow, 111 on Sunday. And Ross, if we're lucky, by the middle of next week, we might gradually drop a little closer to 105 on Thursday. If we're lucky, Justin, thanks. That was your 13 Action News update. You can always find more on our website, ktnv.com, and our free mobile app. Have a great Friday and enjoy your weekend.